Hello everybody, so in today's video I'm gonna show you how to download and install the Waystones mod for Minecraft Java in 2025. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser and I will have links in the description if you need them, but just go to your search bar and search up for mod winf like so. Once you did this, you should see modwinf.com. Just click on modwinf and you should be on the modwinf homepage. Now, all you want to do is go to the top of the website to discover content and go down to mods. Then, all you want to do here is go and search mods and type in waystones. Waystones. And here you should see waystones here. So just click the name. And you'll be sent to the Waystones homepage on Modwinf. So, what you want to do here is go to the versions tab, and now you want to go to game versions. Here, you want to select what Minecraft version you want to play Waystones with. So, I'm going to select the latest Minecraft update here, and here you'll see that we have Forge, Neo Forge, or Fabric. I'll be using Fabric, so this one here. So, I'll be using Fabric 1.21.4. And to download the option here, and to download the version, you just want to do the green yellow button here, and you'll have Waystones here. But there is dependencies. So if we go to the version name here, and we scroll down a tiny bit, we'll see Balm and Fabric API. So all you have to do here is click on Balm, then you want to go to versions. And then you want to go to game versions and select the same game version as you did for Waystones. And of course, it has to be the same platform. So in this case, Fabric. And if we click the version name for Balm, we see that we have Fabric API. And we can just click this one instead of the Waystones version because it is the same one. So we just do Fabric API. We are sent to this page now. So we just go to versions. We go to game versions. And we select the same game version as Balm and Waystones. And you just want to click the latest release, so green, for your specific version of Fabric API. And you should have downloaded Fabric API, Balm Fabric, and Waystones. Now, all you want to do is go to a new tab and you want to search up Fabric Minecraft. So, Fabric Minecraft. And here you should see FabricMC.net, so just click the link. And you'll be sent to the Fabric homepage. Now, all you want to do is go to the blue download button and you want to click on Download for Windows. Then, you should have Fabric Installer. So, once you have these four items, just close your web browser and open up your downloads folder. Here, all you want to do is double click the Fabric Installer and you should see a Minecraft versions list here. So, here you can scroll down and make sure this number matches with the three mods you have here. If it does, just do install, OK, and close. Now, just go to your Minecraft launcher, and with the Minecraft launcher, we'll be able to add in the mods folder the three mods. So here we see that we have Fabric Loader, all good. And if we go to the top of the launcher to installations, we'll see that we have Fabric Loader. Just click on the folder icon. And we send to the .minecraft folder here. So just click on mods and double click, it should be empty. So just go to downloads, select and copy the three mods. Go to the top left arrow to go back to the previous folder, which in my case is mods, and click paste. In the .minecraft mods folder, you should have Fabric API, Balm, and Waystones. Now all you want to do is go to the Minecraft launcher. You want to go to play, make sure Fabric Loader is selected, and click play. Okay, so once we're Minecraft here, we can go ahead and try out the mod. So, if we go to single player, and we go and create a new world, we'll be able to try out Waystones. So this is mainly meant to be used in survival. I'll just use it in creative. And once we are in a world, all you want to do is test out the Waystone mod. It's really easy to use. So 
basically all you need to do here is just go to inventory you should see a little page here so page one slash two click that and you have all the items you need so if we just get ourselves a waste stone just to make everything nice and easy we can put one here so here for example we can call it anything so i'll do one and you can visible day one so here we have one waste stone called one and if we place one all over on this tree we can call it two everyone and they are now connected so if i want to teleport to this one over there i just right click this one you want to teleport to one and i'm now here i go to two and i'm now here so it is quite easy to use now there is more advanced settings but in the gist of it this is kind of what we have here so yeah in today's video i showed you how to download and install waystones for minecraft java so if you like this video make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one bye